Vegas SHOT Show 2024. Uh, we just got in last night. Big thanks to Circa. We're staying at Circa a Hotel and Casino, uh, which is where we stayed last year. And they're so good to us. They really, they really go out of their way to make sure we're comfy there. So we love Circa. And then we are at the Range Day at SHOT Show, which is the first year we've ever gone here. I've been here, I've been to SHOT Show like eight years, but we never go to the Range Day just because I'm always like, I don't know if it's gonna be easy to film out there. It might be too many guns going off, which there are a lot. But uh, we got into range day, which is kind of hard, uh, but Sons of Liberty Gunworks hooked us up and got us into the range day. And there are just tons of exhibitors out here and there's actually shooting. So the actual shot show floor that we always go to, to meet all the companies, see all the new guns and everything, no shooting, no anything there. This one day though, the very first day of shot show that we always miss is all shooting. So we're out here at Sons of Liberty, booth first, gonna shoot some guns, they got a new caliber they're unveiling, and then we're gonna walk the line and see what we can see. Welcome to SHOT Show 2024. Six millimeter max. Yep. First gun, 10 and a half inch barrel. It's incredibly soft recoil. We're gonna run around 3,000 feet per second. Check that bad boy out. Grain? Yeah, let's do it. The 105 grain here. Shoo! Yeah, that doesn't yeah. move at all. No. It feels great. What's the speed coming out of here? It's over 3,000. On a short barrel? Yeah, out of the 10.5. That's pretty nice. Out of, with the 58 grain barrel, that thing's moving. Hell yeah. You are now in the presence of a... I'm a huge six arc fan, so the fact that we get something that's dedicated to that, yeah. so it's perfect for your insurgent stuff, and I love it mainly for hunting is really my biggest thing. Uh, that I'm pumped. The Flow 22 tie, full 3D printed, first flow through 3D printed 22 suppressor, 57 rated, uh, full auto rated, uh, no barrel length restrictions. This thing is super light, and the performance of this thing as far as accuracy and point of impact shift, uh, reduction on that is incredible, and the repeatability. So those guys that love like 22 competition shooting, this is, would be the can to go with. Um, our first full size 5.56 with the Venom 5.56, so nothing really too different other than different direct thread, hub compatible, uh, flow through can that we wanted to give someone a price point option, mixed with CNC machining, and then mixed with 3D printing technology, so, and then easier to service and maintenance. Crazy. Um, but also gives you the same peak performance that you get in our fully 3D printed monocore suppressors, uh, which we found is to be very odd, the fact that you can have something removable and still keep peak performance the same. Uh, so sometimes I'm like, this thing's probably outperforming our more expensive so cans. Um, and then we have something that's unique, is the first flow through shotgun suppressor. I had this forked on, I wasn't thinking about it when we brought it. Right now, this is only dedicated or compatible to the Genesis Preacher shotgun, uh, but it's the first shotgun suppressor, not only that it's flow through, it handles birdshot, buckshot, um, slugs, everything training it's slugs. It's made to be like a light. standoff? Super light, yeah, made for dedicated to breaching, so really yeah. our goal is reducing the I risk of light. TBI. It is very light. Mitigating any sort of toxic back, but mainly mitigating the, the pressure that you get from concussion blasts. So that is the main goal with that, is to give all of our certain operators that are working. It's a very niche, uh, but it showcases the, I guess, the ability with flow through and shotgun and what the future kind of holds with what we're developing. So we were gonna showcase some other things with this, but right now, there's still some things that we wanted to work on. This is fully ready. Also passes the first. We created a SOCOM test that's never been, because shotgun SOCOM has never been a thing. So we had to create testings that can do some durability tests. This thing can go beyond the SOCOM testing and we still have yet to break it. And even we've tried to break it through some things and it continues to withstand a lot of that. So it takes and handles dust and it takes wads and it won't like break internals in any way. Um, our engineers who design it really, I mean, we've gone through all kinds of different things to make it work proper. It, it's pretty cool. It's awesome, man. Yeah, we have that ready live on the breacher shotguns that you guys. Is there any way you could look down that? Yeah, I can see through can it. You yep. see through it and see where the holes are, the ports are in there. Uh, I can't really see the ports. Yeah, it's hard to see. It's pretty neat. It's like the first half of it is ported, then it's smooth after that. It's like 
pretty cool. Is intended for law enforcement military breaching applications or even that concerned uh, responsibly armed citizen who just wants a short shotgun. I mean, why not? The muzzle device on our shotgun is fixed. We have a proprietary short recoil system where the barrel actually moves back during the operation of the gun. And so Huxworks had the challenge of designing some sort of shotgun suppressor that not only worked for our gun, but would reliably fire any round that we put through this. The Gen 12 shotgun will reliably fire anything from birdshot to slug and everything in between. This one in particular is a machine gun. This one's full auto and it'll cycle 12 gauge slugs, birdshot, buckshot at full auto reliably, consistently. Uh, these have thousands of rounds on them. So do go full auto? <laughs> want to get He's like, here. man. Want to get kicked off, yes. They told me I can't go full auto. If you want to get kicked off. We just got here. We can't get kicked out yet. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> For a Man, five inch, 12 gauge, and you were able to keep that gun super flat. Didn't knock you on your ass, no, right? No, no, that's pretty awesome. That was so fast, that was almost full auto. That was basically, he, he was about to kick me out. <laughs> Too slow. <laughs> Too slow. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I was actually scared that it was some kind of crazy fan, like, yeah. And he was right. Y'all got more of these hats? Uh, not right now. I need one of those hats. Cool. We'll send you a box to them. Perfect. These guys are the guys who give me vodka on the SHOT Show floor. Biggest difference is on the enhanced buttons here, so you can manipulate them with a glove. And also, the old one took the CR123 batteries. This one has the internal battery, which now will charge it inside the unit. And the recoil rating has gone up because the old one, which was 650G, which was rated for 308, this is now up to 1000G. So if you want to put it on that 450 SOCOM full auto, might be, it might be a good test. Enhanced, the focus ring is a lot simpler. So it's just like a three step. You don't have that big where you just dial, dial, dial. And also the zoom on it, where the old one, when you would zoom, it would kind of jump. Yep. This one is more like a like a legit camera. When you zoom, a it's more like smooth. Yeah, smooth. Grab your mag and shoot that. Sure, yeah. That's cool. We need thermal on a rifle. We don't have that. All we have is a thermal drone. We have thermal For in the now. air, but we need thermal on the ground. Yes. Hey, look what I can do. Hey, look at me. Hey, look. So we're going to run the 4,500 PSI in the tank and regulate it down to 800 PSI. We're shooting 100 feet per second with a 1,248 grain arrow. That's giving us about 28 foot pounds out of the muzzle. Got a mount that you can put, you can put a bottle reel on or a standard reel on, so it's your choice. Can we shoot it? Yeah. This has an O-ring in the bottom, so when you go in, you'll feel that O-ring set in there. Okay. You never saw a boat. Uh-uh. So yeah, it's like boat fishing, but it's got a gun with air pressure in it. Yeah. So you get about you get about 65 shots. 65? Yeah. Dang. Before you got to. I'm gonna make it full auto and kill all the fish. This is how you charge it. Okay. You gotta talk it back till it clicks. And then when you're ready, this is your safety. Okay. I'll tell you how to aim. Pull all the way back. Yep. Did you? Okay. It clicked. Yeah. Okay. Take it off safety. Try to shoot his head. Try to shoot his head. I don't got any sights on no, it. Don't worry about it. Go right. a little lower. Go lower. lower. Go lower. Go lower. Go lower. Right there. Yeah. <laughs> got him. Hell yeah. yeah. <laughs> when you, you know, you're in the heat of the moment, you got fish on. You got to turn so you can fight the fish and get your fish back in. Gotcha. Jenna loves animals, and I'm making her shoot that fish. Did I get it? Yeah. You so killed if it. A fish, if, a, if you're shooting it, good fish. He was just enjoying family life. Monster. We're going to shoot the Q boombox full auto. 8.6, subsonics. If all these losers would get out of the way. I'm just kidding, you guys are probably great. You're great. Appreciate you, man. <laughs> yeah. oh, stop that, <laughs> stop, that's a family channel. Oh. Oh, Boombox, it's like a radio for all you children. Like you. For the children who don't know. at 86 seen that on the channel from Q 86 blackout got this gun dirty today
dude. Yeah, that's, that's pretty, cool. pretty cool. Yeah, we need that in our life, and it needs to be full auto. Well, Kevin so promised us the first boombox. We're getting a boombox soon. That, this is the Q boombox. I should check that out right there. He said in the book here they have granulated tungsten. That's my area. Don't go in it. It's really nice of them to name that after me. <laughs> Get off my area. You might be able to hear it, I don't know, but the wind's picking up. It's getting colder out here, the rain's starting. We're gonna get out of here. We go play in Vegas for the rest of the day. And then we got Walk in the Floor Shot Show uh, tomorrow. We'll, uh, yeah, we're out of here, later. I bet you it goes super far. I believe in you. Country Club? No. Yeah. Oh. Used to real grass. This year's SHOT Show, I'm trying to work out every day. Uh, it's actually the next morning. I worked out yesterday too. That's two days in a row. We're trying to uh, party less, which is hard because it's Vegas, and work out more. So two days in a row. Um, so now, we're gonna take a shower, and then we are going to SHOT Show. I'm gonna end this video right here, start the next one at SHOT Show. Oh, and I love you. Thanks for watching. <laughs>